Hey everybody and welcome back to another episode. So I ended at a very abrupt point in the last part because I was entering a mission that I know for a fact is going to be pretty long because um, it's basically defending the island from a bunch of soldiers I believe. I think it's this one. I think there's another one that comes straight after it as well. So for this part we'll be doing that. If you could leave a like, a comment and subscribe that would be great. Again, though, how does so Bill Williams become so thin must be the boat he called in by the Cuba. first game? That's a goddamn warship. Oh. You kind of have to hand it to this feller. So I guess great minds think alike. So what now? We fight or we win. Any of you boys feel like running? So what do we do? I will go get the cannon ID. Okay, let's get to it. <laughs> Where was I supposed to stand there? I couldn't tell. Shoot them, man. Shoot them. Rebels on the beach. I see them. There's more coming down the right side of the beach. Okay, do I shoot the guys on the beach? Because I thought I was... I, I don't know. Ah, I'm just going with it. Just to make sure that guy is dead. Oh, Perkul. What's he been doing all this time? Shouldn't we be using that to take the boat out first? Wouldn't more guys just be coming from the boat to the beach? Got that shotgun out there. I hope to be thinking. There's a lot of guns out there. So what do we do? I say we push forward because if we don't, we're gonna die here and now. Okay then. Follow me. This is kind of fun. This must be where Dutch gets that taste for war he has in the first game. Oh! Yeah, where are you guys going? I'm taking out these guys. Oh, okay. Ah! Oh, his head popped like a watermelon. That wasn't good. Oh, there it is. Okay, is there any food I got? No. Okay. Ugh. Oh, wow. Keep going! Just a few left now! 
Let's get down to the beach. This is not over yet. Is he swimming for it? Really? Look out! Another boat just made Well, I can't hit them, so yeah. That was a decent choice. Damn it, Dutch, what are you what are you doing? Yeah, this this should have been the first thing we did. That's the problem. It doesn't matter how many we kill, he will have the money to get more. Watch out! Down! We will have to climb up around this side. This way. With you. That one's going right for Dutch. You okay on that? Come on! Uh, ma? So you said something about going for the back. Uh, I give up. Yeah, it's fine, we got the time. Don't worry about that. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, I'm sure it was a lovely looking ship. I didn't see it. Can't really see it properly in this light, but I'm sure it was beautiful. Titanic beautiful. That was quite some shooting right, okay. boys. Thank you. What now? Oh, they'll be back. But I found a boat for you. And he should be arriving on the dock any time now. Great. Micah, go meet with the captain. If he's amenable and discreet, tell him we'll be ready to set sail soon. Bill, come help me collect poor old Javier. Sure. And cool. It was a great pleasure to make your acquaintance. Just yeah, get out of my way, guys. <coughs> I got a lot of respect for the dead and all, but I'll just walk. Again, the hair's not growing that quickly, but the beard. Where's he going? This boat doesn't happen to be on the other side of the, the island, is it? I thought I was dead for sure. Hi, boys. We got a real problem. Nice Mr. Fusar don't want us going nowhere. He knows just who we are. If he can keep us here for a few more days, well... And what about the captain of the ship here? They got him trussed up like a hog. Guards all over the place. Got us surrounded with gun positions. So when we try to sail out, he's gonna blow holes in us. This fella is really beginning to try my patience. He ain't even had you tortured yet. <laughs> I like the man's style. He's thorough, nasty, and vindictive. However... In this instance, I don't see we got any alternative, but we go and free our friendly captain and destroy the artillery. 
For once, I agree with you. Hair cool? Oh, I'll fight Alberto Fusa every day I can. All right. Bill, you're gonna guard Javier on the ship here. Micah, Arthur, let's get to work. Hair cool? We follow you. Hanale, this way. Quick! Let's get up around the back of that artillery post. Yeah, these are like a very good collection of missions, I think. Like different from the regular stuff where you just sort of pick and choose and uh, so on. <coughs> With like all the weapons you buy. This is more like survivalist kind of thing, I guess. There's two guards. You just have to Are use whatever you scavenge. Uh, which I quite yeah, I quite enjoy that aspect of it. You take out the first guy, and I'll get the other one, okay? Wrong way. Plant the explosives. You got it secured properly, cowpoke? I think so. Knowing you, I have my doubts. Shut up, my kid. <laughs> Come on, run! Aha! That was a thing of beauty. Right through the head. I might use a shotgun more often, this is kind of fun. Ah, and I'm dead. That only happened because I was cocky. I'll admit it. I got very sort of full of myself with that shotgun. It was like, yeah, these guys don't. But he goes down remarkably easily. Every time. Yeah, I got you that time. Bastard. Wait here for a second for the others to catch up. I'll get the dynamite rigged on these cannons. There'll be more coming. We'll hold them off. Up here, Archer. We'll have a better view. Yeah, I don't like this gun. Uh, the Springfield rifle, or whatever it's called. I don't. Yeah. Ah, oh, really? Come on! There's another set of cannons up ahead. And again, and 
unlucky soul. Okay, I'm gonna get in position this time. No, oh, please, God. Right, fine. I'll get the dynamite rigged on these cannons. There'll be more coming. We'll hold them off. Up here, Arthur. We'll have a better view. Yeah, Micah. Yeah, fat okay, bitch. Boys, we are live. Stand back. The captain's being held in the workers' compound. This way. How do you know that? Then again, he's the guy who came over to tell us, so. We going in? Yeah. On your mark, Arthur. Let's go. Okay, they're already shooting. Forget my mark, come on. I got you now, you bastard. We are all bastards, my friend. But only one of us is some would-be emperor's whore. We know who you are. And nobody knows who you are. Not even your goddamn father. You maggots are going to die. Eventually, I'm sure we will. But not today, and not because of you. The U.S. Navy is on the way. I am sure they are, which is why you're going to let us leave. Or you are dying right here, my friend. We've killed better men than you fools. Here! <laughs> I like the way he walked about with no just taking pot right. shots as he was going. Thank you, Captain. It wasn't even any big, he was just shooting I in that direction. Man in my cargo. Dutch Vanderlyn, I am sorry you got hurt. Uh, Captain Sam. Let's go. Gentlemen. Oh. Back to the ship. Come on. What happened to Fusar? He escaped? I didn't see him. Damn it! They have sent the enforcements! Let's go! Another one! Shoot him! Keep going! Just get to that boat! On the left, this one on the rock. Come on, let's finish this corner. Get up and get close and personal with these guys. 
Shotgun for the win. Ah, oh, that was disgusting. His head came apart. I don't know where I'm going. Aha, uh -huh, there we go. Hey. I got it for you, Javier. Captain, can you handle the ship? I'll be fine. Come on. We'll get going with the tide before I get any more surprise interviews with local officials. Are you gonna be okay? We'll be like you. We'll disappear probably. Back to IT. Believe me. We'll be long gone by morning. Good. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> we survived. Just about. What now? Uh, uh, what now? What do you mean, what now? I mean, we're headed back to Lemoyne again, and we're all wanted men. <laughs> we slip ashore one by one, find out what's what. We don't cut and run now? Head back to Blackwater. No. Why not? Because the last thing they'll be thinking is for us to turn up. We've been on the run for a while now, and it feels like, like our luck has turned. You know, I ain't turning back. I had a good run of it, I guess. We ain't even played our hand yet. We just need to put some more money in our pockets. Make our escape. Broke, alone, they're gonna pick us off one by one. And you know it. Maybe. Not. Maybe. We need to split up. Keep a low profile. Try to track down the rest. But carefully. See if they send any mail. Arthur, you check Shady Bell. We'll find each other eventually. We always do. And then what? Then we meet up. We gather the family, we get some money, and get the hell out of there. That's the plan. We all acting crazy. And uh, that's not what I thought we were going to be doing here. We have here. been in a bad way. Listen. I will kill for my family. Any of you want to judge me for that? That's fine. But that is who I am. Anyone disagree? Anyone? Well, that's fair. And, you know, it doesn't mean any less coming from the mouth of a known crazy person. This is basically the fall, I think, of his like you know mental stability um from like the bank job onwards and then uh, eventually he'll just become that crazy person who lives in the woods fighting his own personal war with a bunch of native americans ah dear uncle tacitus Alrighty, uh, I'm going to actually call it a day here and carry on from this point in the next uh, part. Hope you've all enjoyed this part and the commentary and so on and so forth. Um, yeah, the next part's going to be pretty good. I know there's like one of the two songs, Stand and Broken. No, I can't remember which song. I can't remember which song actually plays in this one. But uh, yeah, it's one of like the two songs in the game. Uh, which is fine. I think there was like two songs in the first game as well. Or at least I know there's one where you go to Mexico, um, and then you cross the border, and there's another one where you 
ride back to meet your family in your ranch. So yeah, that's about right. Same as the first game. Anyway, enough of my prattling on. I'll see you in the next part. Please take care, please have a great day, and carry on gaming. See you then.